Hi everybody, we are at the Imagination Station. I'm here with Carl Nelson. You have the safety glasses on, I know what that means. We're gonna have a flame here in a bit, so you probably put those okay, on for now. Okay, per usual, Carl's favorite. We're what gonna, are we doing today? Talking about sound. Okay. We're gonna make sound by getting air to move through a tube. Hmm. Okay, and we can try to blow through this, and if you do that, nothing really happens. But if sure. you spin it, we can fling the air out and generate some different tones. Hmm. Also, it kinda sounds like a song. So the deal is that everything that has a volume of air in it has what we call like a resonant frequency. All right. And so by slinging the air out the end, we can excite that resonant frequency inside this tube and make it generate that tone. Hmm. Now, that's something you could do at home if you had a plastic pipe. Sure. But I want to do something that involved flame a little bit. Okay, you might not have this at home. You might not have this at home. All so right. this is probably not the one to try at home. <laughs> so we've got two little burners here, and we've got these pipes. Okay, go ahead and pick yours up. You actually might want to put the gloves on because they'll probably get a little warm as All we right. heat them up. You know what? I. We'll heed your warning, Carl. So we're gonna use the flame to heat up a little metal grill that's down inside the tube. All right. So if you look down inside there, you can see there's like uh, a, a, Yeah, I don't know if we can see that through the camera here, but you can see a little. little I have break. a way to make it more visible. Oh. What we're gonna do is, is it at this end? Yes, Perfect. it is. Go ahead and take your tube and put it over the flame. We're gonna heat that grill up until it gets red hot. Oh, that's and the tube. The, yeah, that's the tube, yeah. <laughs> so go ahead and take it off. Okay and just hold it there. All right, so put it back on. So maybe that's just, it's working well that way. We're heating up that grill inside. It is generating all sorts of turbulent air flowing up through the tube. Okay. And if you take it off the flame now, it's not gonna cooperate for us. Here, let's swap. You okay. take, take the little tube. I will take the little tube. We'll do the same thing. We're gonna heat these up. And, and I'm heating up the grill, right? Grill facing grill. me, all right. We're gonna get the grill really, really hot. Mm -hmm. And when that happens, I'm gonna pull this away. You know what, we need more flame. Your tube has a different it does. frequency. Go ahead and tip it sideways. Sound stops because the air can't move through. Tip it back up. Air starts moving through and you get that tone. Very so cool. So you have a higher pitch because we have a smaller volume of air. Okay, and you needed to use a higher amount of fuel because this one's so much longer? Well, I think I actually had it upside down. Oh. So yeah, yeah, I yeah. actually wasn't heating the grill up. Well, okay. That's, that's okay, go ahead and put that one down. I want, right. This is really cool. Two pipes, identical length. Okay. Sure, they look the same. Go ahead and heat yours up over the flame. All right. I'll do the same with mine. We'll go back to the Bunsen burners here. And we're gonna try to get that grill really hot. So lower it down a little bit more, that's perfect. We're gonna get them hot mm -hmm. and then go ahead and take yours off. You hear that? Mm -hmm. that? Go ahead and flip your sideways. That's a beat frequency because the tubes are actually not exactly the same length. Okay. So they might be off by just a few, maybe one or two hertz. And we're getting that difference in the different frequencies, called the beat frequency. Heat it up one more time. Okay, one more time. And what we're gonna do this time is, it's kinda like that power twins activate thing. All right. We're, we're gonna get them <laughs> making sounds, okay? Uh -huh. So go ahead and pull it off the flame. Listen. That's both wow. tubes. Okay, flip it sideways. So a really interesting thing happens when you bring both tubes next together. to one another. Yeah. The uh, oscillations sort of coalesce together and they start oscillating at the same frequency. But when you pull them apart, they go back to their natural frequency. Wow. So some really cool acoustics that happens with a simple steel pipe, a burner, and a grill inside so you get some hot air to move through the pipe. The science of frequencies and acoustics. That's cool Carl stuff. Nelson, thanks so much. And just a reminder, you can come down to the Imagination Station. Of course, with the holiday parade today, they will be open. And it's Saturday, so children 12 and under get in free with a paid adult if you live in Lucas County. It's also the end of National Chemistry Week, and that's how you imagine it.